Hello guys and welcome back. It is the life of all here. Today we're going to be doing something a little bit different. I decided that it would be fun to do like a little bit of a science-y video, sort of like life hack stuff or other things like that that could be cool to watch. So hope you guys enjoy this video. If you do, make sure to give it a big thumbs up, like and subscribe, and see you guys in the video. Okay guys, for the first one, you are going to need a little thing of water like this. You'll also need some pepper and dish soap. So first, you take the pepper and then you just sort of crank it into the water. So there's just some stuff floating on top of the water. As you guys can see, there is floating pepper in this water. So what you do is you take the dish soap, uh, put some on your finger, and then if you want to clean out your water with all the pepper, you just stick your finger in the middle of the water, and boom, it all moves away from your finger. And then you have the cleaner water in the middle here, and all the pepper is stuck to the outside of the water. So that's the first one, let's move on to the next one. All right guys, this is number two. For this one, we are going to be doing the hot water and cold water. For the cold water, we will put a little bit of blue food coloring in it to show that that one is the blue or the cold water right there. Uh, stir it up a bit. Alright. So we have the cold water. And then over here, we have the warm water. So I'll put red food coloring in that one. To show the warmth. I will mix this one up too. So you'll also need a piece of paper or something to do this. So first off, we're gonna be putting the cold water on top of the warm water. So you're gonna wanna set this on here like so. And flip it upside down fast enough that it sort of sticks and holds. You wanna put it over the top of the warm water and slowly pull it out. Uh-oh, I kind of missed. As you can see, the colors are mixing together to create a purple color. I suggest using plastic, not paper, because as you can tell, it ripped, but it turned purple and it was supposed to stay different colors, but not with this one. So I will do the warm over the cold this time. First, let me go get something new to use since that one ripped. See you guys in a bit. One hour later. All right, guys, it's time to put the warm on top of the cold water. So let's put the new envelope on top of that one. Flip it over, it's gonna leak a little. Put it up on top of here, try and line them up to not make a huge mess. I'm gonna try and pull this one out as well. As you can kind of see, the Red is on the top and the blue is on the bottom. It's sort of mixed because the paper ripped and it kind of messed it up. But that's supposed to be red on the top and blue on the bottom. It sort of is compared to that one, which is the same color. But yeah, let's move on to the next one. 
All right, guys, time for number three. This one is the underwater explosion. You will need canola oil or any kind of oil, then salt and a uh, food coloring of any color. Depends on what you want to see. So you put the canola oil on top of the water. It will float down, but then bubble back up. And it will sit there on the top as you guys can see, then you take your food coloring and you sort of just drip it on the top in different spots. It will stay clumped as you can see, kind of just float around in there separately, just little drops here and there. And then you take the salt and you put it in the canola oil and soon you'll start seeing these underwater explosions as you can see here sort of just exploding under the water in a cool fashion as you can kind of see here they sort of sink down because of the salt and then just explode I will add a little bit more salt so it drips more and you guys can see it. Alright. Hopefully the two big ones right th there we go. See they just explode. So that is number three. Hopefully you guys thought that one was cool. You could make them bigger, put bigger drops in and just have fun with it and see you guys in the next one all right guys time for number four this one is more of like a trick you can play on your friends than a life hack but i guess you could call it a life hack if you want so for this one uh like you could get your friends and be like hey can you put this paper clip on the water and have it sit on the top without it sinking well it's metal so no matter like what they try, it'll just sink to the bottom. But if you take a paper clip like this, and then you just sort of bend it into an L sort of shape, I guess. Then you take another paper clip and set it on top of the little L shape and just slowly set it down in the water. It'll float on top like so. Not very hard to do, but your friends may not know that trick, and it just sits there floating. And that will be it for today. Hope you all enjoyed. If you did, make sure to smash that like button and subscribe if you're new. And if we can reach, let's say, five likes, I will do another one of these videos. And... Goodbye.